Isn't it fascinating how a few lines on our graph V quality waves can help us determine abnormalities with one of the most fascinating organ in the human body, our heart. A small narrowing or widening of gap between these seemingly insignificant lines or deviation above or below or increase or decrease in the height of waves can hold multiple meanings. And I am going to use my almost 20 years of experience being a medical student to help you decipher these meanings to diagnose and treat patients. Yes, a student, since 1999 when I joined MBBS, every day has been a learning and it still continues. These ECG waves have always fascinated me. That is why I am a cardiologist. Hi doctors, I am Dr. Vivek Kumar and I am going to teach you all about ECG. I will cover for you the principles of ECG and tell you how to differentiate a normal ECG and an abnormal ECG. All normal ECGs may not look the same, but they do have some features in common. After the basics, we will go to ECG in acquired heart diseases as well as coronary artery disease. Discuss cases of bradyarrhythmia and tachyarrhythmia how to interpret them and see real findings to build real experience. Professor Matre said, more is missed by not looking than not knowing. I will teach you what to look for when looking at an ECG. This is my training session, my prep clinic. Join me and let's talk ECG. Prep Clinic, dream beyond.